Philly fans, Charles Grievous here with GoBlackKnights.com with senior linebacker Jackson Powell. Uh, hey, Jackson, first of all, how was practice today? I was good. Um, it was good to just get out there, um, kind of see some of the plays uh, we're going to see uh, on Friday during this game, um, just get some full speed reps in and um, try to get better at those, those fundamentals that we're going to need um, in order to win our one-on-one -on -one battles in this game. It was good. Fantastic. Now, I'm going to talk about the road runners in a minute. Um, but my guess is that many Army fans don't realize, uh, you know, how active your recruiting was coming out of high school as part of uh, the 2020 recruiting class. I mean, you were a rival's three-star prospect. You held offers from, from Syracuse, Coastal Carolina, uh, Air Force, Louisville, Virginia Tech, and several others. And, and, and by the way, uh, you come out of a outstanding uh, program uh, at Buford, which is one of the powerhouses uh, down in Georgia, actually in, in, in the country. Uh, so uh, when, we, when I think about your journey, uh, uh, football journey at the academy, it kind of reminds me of former Army linebacker John Radigan, who really kind of this senior year was his breakout year, if you will. Uh, mm -hmm. Can you kind of relate to that and talk about both your maturation and even the patience uh, over the last four years? Uh, yes, sir. Um, I just think I've I've been blessed with my journey here. Um, I wouldn't change this this past four years for anything. Um, just being able to learn under guys like Andre Carter, obviously these past couple years, um, just like the different techniques he used and um, the way he went about his business, just the way he worked every day, trying to get better. Um, so I've just used these past, I guess three three and a half, four years just to continue to get better, um, try and help the team in any um, any way I can on special teams or other packages, uh, whatever, that may, whatever that may be. And then this year, just going in, trying to help the younger guys um, in my position group, teach them uh, all the stuff I know, and um, just try and help them continue to develop and continue to develop myself every day. Fantastic. And let's go back to uh, last Saturday's game. A huge win for you guys. Shut out uh, Delaware State, 57-0, your first start. Uh, talk cool. about how that felt for you. Um, it was great um, to get that start and just uh, coaches having confidence in me. Um, felt good to go out there. Obviously, um, a home game, first home game of the season. Uh, only get so many, of, so many more of those this season. So it felt really good to go out there in front of our home crowd, get a shutout um, and just uh, play, play pretty good on defense. Uh, we still have a lot of, we can improve on, but it felt, felt really good. Fantastic. And, and by the way, your parents are probably two of the most active and engaging army football fans <laughs> around. Can you yes. talk about what their support has meant for you on this West Point journey and army football journey? Oh yeah. It's felt, uh, it's, it's meant the world uh, to me. Um, their support and um, just I'm a I'm a big family guy so um, just having their support like coming to all the games pretty much all the games um, my dad is really active on social media which um, is is awesome as well um, and they're just they're great they always um, come and show support at all the games and whenever I need to call them or talk to them about anything football or otherwise related. Um, they're always there. So they're really great. And I, I appreciate them for everything that they do. That's absolutely awesome. And, mm -hmm. and now let's talk a little bit about the role runners of uh, UTSA. Uh, they're very experienced, versatile offensive unit. Uh, my final question is, uh, what must you guys do as a unit to slow them down uh, on Friday? Um, I think just focusing on our fundamentals and techniques and making sure we're sound on our assignments. Um, they're very, it's going to be a challenge for us, but um, we're looking forward to it and just trying to get better each and every day, focus on what we can do to improve and um, uh, make this a great, uh, great travel down there. Fantastic. Hey, listen, appreciate your time this evening. Best of luck to Thank you me. guys on Friday and uh, come back with the win. Thank you, sir. Have a good one. Take care now. Bye-bye.